Cycles of freezing and thawing cause more damage to waterborne latex paints than when the paints are subjected to steady freezing. That's why their stability is carried out in freeze-thaw cycles, making the test conditions more uncompromising. In this episode, I will discuss the freeze-thaw test according to the ASTM procedure that we carried out for prepared paint samples with ESPERS FT600 additive. The test used 24-hour procedure in which samples were frozen in one pint cans at 0 degrees Fahrenheit. After 17 hours, the samples are removed and thawed at the room temperature. After 7 hours thawing, the cans are placed back in the freezer. The test is repeated 5 times every 24 hours. It's time to assess the conditions of our samples in the cans when the test is completed. The control samples show scenarios, a rubbery appearance and the paint is damaged. It's still liquid but forms chunks and little thick cottage cheese. This indicates a rating of 4 as a moderate failure. The paint with 1% Esperse FT600 is liquid it also contains lumps, but it's not a viscous. Its viscosity can be measured and the rating was given 9. Both 3 and 5% Esper's FT600 paint samples are still liquid, show no changes and are both rated 10. After assessing the paint sample on the spatula, it's time to measure viscosity changes using a stormer viscometer. The graph shows that samples with ESPERS FT600 show no viscosity drift after 5 freeze and thaw cycles. The control sample has an out-of-scale viscosity. The next step is to assess the appearance of the paint coatings in relation to the samples before freezing. For this purpose, drawdown is performed using an automatic film applicator and comparing the appearance and gloss of the coatings after 5 cycles of freezing and thawing with those of the coatings before freezing. Significant differences can be seen in the coatings applied on the charts. The control samples shows clearly visible failure. The 1% ESPERS FT600 coating also shows changes and it's flat. Coatings with 3 and 5% ESPERS FT600 show gloss and no failure. Visual assessments are complemented by gloss measurements using a gloss meter. The results show that the addition of ESPERS FT600 allows to obtain a higher gloss of the coating with increasing dosage level in the formulation. If you want to know the full results of formulation development, I encourage you to read our technical bulletin where you will find extensive data. ESPERS FT600 is an adjective additive that can protect your paints in winter conditions, extending open time and wet edge and increasing gloss. 
Order eSpurs FT600 sample from Edox Chemicals and test it in your formulations. If you need any external support in the area of formulations or testing, please contact me directly. Thank you for your attention and I hope that our work will allow you to formulate latex paints better and faster. See you in the next video and subscribe our YouTube channel to stay informed.